Praise the Lord. Good morning. To God be the glory for all his great things he is doing continually in our lives. So thank you, Lord, for a new day. We're going to be continuing in the reading of the word on this morning. I'm just going to read uh, two scriptures. We're in Proverbs chapter 27. And um, I'm going to read verses 1 and 2. And then we'll just switch over to another uh, scripture. But uh, we're going to just continue in the reading of the word. I just hope that you are blessed by the word. I hope that you would adhere to the word and follow along. So it says, do not brag about tomorrow since you don't know what the day will bring. Let someone else praise you, not your own mouth. A stranger, not your own lips. Um, that was from the NIV version. The King James Version says, don't boast. Boast not thyself for tomorrow, for thou knowest not what tomorrow will bring forth. Let another man praise another man praise thee, and not thine own mouth, a stranger, and not thine own lips. Um, it is very important that we boast not. When we boast, we ought to boast in the Lord and the Lord only. I'm going to turn to uh, uh, 2 Corinthians chapter uh, 10. And um, verse 17, it says, as the scripture says, if you want to boast, boast only about the Lord. When people commend themselves, it does not count for much. The important thing is for the Lord to commend them. So when we boast, we boast only in Christ. We don't give ourselves praise and recognition. Um, we allow the Lord to boast on on us and we allow people to command us but we don't take the glory from God so on this morning we're gonna pray for the spirit of humility pray that uh, God continue to get the glory out of our lives and that uh, the praises will go up unto the Father and not unto unto us so we want to thank God for what he's doing um, I'm continually giving him the glory. Ephesians 2, I'm going to read another scripture. says, Ephesians 2, 8 and 9 says, for, for it is by grace you have been saved through faith. And this is not from yourself. It is the gift of God, not by works, so that no one can boast. Um, so we understand that boasting should only be in Christ. We do nothing. We are nothing. He is everything. God is everything. So on this morning, we pray that God be glorified. Let us lift up the name of Jesus on this morning. <clears throat> thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Father, thank you. Have your way, Lord Jesus. Thank you. Father, we thank you on this morning. God, you are welcome in our homes. You're welcome in our lives. You're welcome and <clears throat> whatever we do, God, that you would be glorified. You're welcome, God. We belong to you. We give ourselves unto you on this morning. We ask, so God, that you have your way in our lives. Father, we come to tell you thank you on today. <clears throat> thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you for what you're doing in our lives. Thank you for being a great Savior. Thank you for being a good Father. Thank you for being so loving and so kind. Father, I am grateful on this morning that we would boast in you. We would boast in your word. We would boast in your salvation. We would boast of your forgiveness. We would boast on the cross. We thank you, God, that by the cross we are saved. We thank you by the blood of Jesus we're saved. We thank you, God, that by grace are we saved, God, through your blood. We thank you, God, that your sacrifices are what we boast upon. We thank you that your love are what we brag about. We thank you, God, that you, oh God, are what we are so excited and joyous about. Father, on this morning, I'm grateful, God. I boast in you. I boast in your love. Oh God, I'm reminded of your word, God, that I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ Jesus, for it is the power of God through salvation that has set us free. Father, thank you for setting us free, God. Thank you, oh God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you for setting us free on this morning. Thank you for liberty, God. Thank you, oh God, for freedom. Thank you, oh God, for the victory. Hallelujah, it belongs to you. Father, I thank you on this morning that we are your children. We are yours, God. We are your handiwork. We are your marvelous masterpieces, God. Father, 
Father, I thank you, God, that you took the time, hallelujah, God, to create your children, God. I thank you, God, that your hands, hallelujah, God, is not short towards us. I thank you, God, that your ear, God, is not closed towards our prayers. I thank you, God, that your hands, oh, God, Hallelujah, present itself daily to us. God, on this morning, I just want to say thank you. Hallelujah, God, thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah, God, thank you. Father, I am so gracious on this morning. I am so thankful for what you're doing. I am so grateful. Hallelujah, God, for what you have already done. Hallelujah, God, I'm so full because your love. Hallelujah, is this groma expressed so faithfully and freely to us. Thank you, Lord. I am so thankful. Hallelujah, God, that your grace extends to your people in the name of Jesus. God, I thank you on this morning. Hallelujah, God. I thank you, God. I thank you. I thank you for what you're doing continually. God, I lift up my voice on this morning and I come to say thank you. Thank you, God. Have your way. Have your way. Have your way, Holy Spirit. Have your way in our lives. Let our lives be a mirror image of you. Let us look in the mirror and see you. Let our joy continually be your joy. Let our strength continue to be your strength. Renew the strength of your people on this morning. Renew the mindsets of your people on this morning. Renew our hearts, God, that we can walk continually with you. Renew our faith daily, God, that our faith will be built in you, God. Increase the faith of your people, God, that we can continue to serve you wholeheartedly without wavering, God, without wavering, not back and forth, but assurance in you. Give your people a faith and a hope and an assurance in you, knowing, God, that your word is true. Father, on this morning, I just want to say thank you. Hallelujah, God, thank you. Glory, hallelujah, God, thank you. Thank you, thank you, God. I'm so graciously uh, I'm grateful on this morning for your grace. I'm grateful for the cross on this morning. I'm grateful for salvation, oh God. I'm grateful, God, for the hope in Christ. I'm grateful on this morning, God, for the love of Christ. I'm grateful on this morning. Hallelujah, God, for the height and the depth, oh God, and the breadth of your love, the extent, oh God, of your love toward your people on this morning. Father, thank you. Thank you for what you're doing, oh God. Thank you for what you've already done. You be glorified, Jesus. In our lives, God, you be praised. You be lifted up. You be exalted. You be glorified, God, in this earth, God. Father, thank you on this morning. Get the glory out of our vessels, God. Let our lives, oh God, be unto you, God. Krosia mama masud rosha. Makushit roro krosi. May you make a commitment to him. Alaromashit roro krosia. With your whole hearts. Mikroma sitria krositria. May the surrender of your lives be unto him. Unto the Lord. Father, I thank you on this morning, God, that hearts are being surrendered. I thank you, God, that minds have been changed. I thank you, God, that directions have been changed. I thank you, God, that we, oh God, look to you, God. I thank you, God, that hearts, hallelujah, God, are being, oh God, mended. Uh, Father, thank you on this morning that you're building up your people in a greater faith in you. Kuramas, mi karama shudrosa. Fokrosidiyama shudrosa tia. All the glory, it belongs to you, Father. You'll be exalted in this nation. You'll be exalted in the lives of your people, God, that your people will totally surrender and commit their hearts and their ways, their lives, their actions, their thoughts, their deeds. 
The entire being of man, God, may it be surrendered to you on this morning. God, you said in your word, God, that your coming is nigh. I pray, God, that you would prepare a nation, God, that they would walk with you. I pray that the nation, oh God, would understand, God, that your hand is outstanding. Is extended once again. Hallelujah, God, that the invitation for Christ is extension. The Ukuruma of his love is extended once again. Hallelujah, God, you keep on saying that my coming is soon. My coming is soon. I pray, God, that your people would understand that in the blink of an eye, your return shall be here. I pray that men would be prepared. I pray that hearts would be surrendered. I pray that lives would be committed and devoted to you. I pray that we lay down ourselves, oh God, and we pick up you, Christ Jesus. We pick up you in our hearts and our minds and our spirits and our bodies. We commend ourselves unto you, God. I pray that families will come into the fold. I pray that you, oh God, will get the glory out of lives. Hallelujah, God, you're constantly saying the same thing over and over. We might think it's repetitive, but God says my grace is extended once again. My hand of mercy is extended once again. My hand of Eucharistia. My hands are open wide. I come in and I come and I will continue. Thank you, Holy Spirit, to knock at the door. If you hear me, Eucharistia. If any man hear my voice, he says, I am Let him in and enter the Eucharistia. If you hear my voice, answer the door. If you want to allow me to come into your heart. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Father, I thank you on this morning. I thank you for what you're doing once again, God. I thank you, God, that you're patiently waiting and you're asking your children to come. Hallelujah, God, because you know, God, that you are soon to return and we ought to understand that your return is soon. Your return is nigh. God, on this morning, I come to tell you thank you. I thank you, God, that you, oh God, will draw your people to you. Father, soften the hearts of your children on this morning. I pray that hearts would be softened, God. I pray that hearts would be surrendered on this morning. I pray that lives would be turned around. I pray that deliverance would take place right now in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, wherever you are in the world, wherever you, whatever you're doing, it does not matter. God is the Ikuruma. He's there. He's present. There is no distance between God and you. Father, on today, we say thank you. Father, come into my life just asking God. God, I give myself to you. I submit my will and my ways to you. I ask that you forgive me of my sins. Take me, Lord. Use me for your glory. Forgive me, oh God. Now, God, live in me. Hallelujah. God, be pleased with me. All of heaven rejoices at the song of a surrendered heart, at the song of a devotion, of a devoted heart and a committed spirit into the hands of the Lord. Hallelujah. God, I thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Father, I thank you, O oh God, for souls into your kingdom on this morning. I thank you, God, for lives coming in, God. I thank you. Hallelujah, Jesus. I thank you, Lord. Have your way, Lord Jesus. Have your way, Lord Jesus. Do a great thing in this nation. Continue to prepare your people, God. Hallelujah. We know not the hour nor the day that Christ shall return, but I pray that souls and minds and hearts will be prepared that we would walk into heavenly places. Father God, the thought of heaven, hallelujah, is a glorious thought. I thank you, Lord Jesus, when I think about, hallelujah, the heavenly presence. Hallelujah, just a glimpse of the gold that is on the streets that is clear as crystal, the transparent, oh God, gold. Hallelujah, like platinum I would describe or clear as water. I would thank you, Lord Jesus. I thank you, God, that your book, hallelujah, the book of Revelation 20 and 21, it shows us clearly how it would be throughout the book of Revelation. Father, I thank you, God, that we inherit your heavenly kingdoms. I look forward to bowing at your feet. I look forward to heavenly places. I look forward to the streets of gold. I look forward, God, to the tree of life. I look forward Hallelujah, God, to see the, the walls that are built with your precious pearls and stones and gems and emeralds. Father, I look forward to the pearly gates, God, that are open wide with the biggest pearls that we can imagine. Father, I thank you on this morning because when you do things, you do things enormous. When you do things, we look at the world, you do things, oh God, super fab fab fabulistic espialidocious. Yes. We used to say that all the time, but when you do things, Lord, you do things unexplainable. 
But Father, I thank you on this morning for lives that are coming in. I thank you, God, for souls that will be delivered and set free. I thank you, God, that people will take heed and hear that you are soon to return, that we walk into the glory of the Lord. So God, we boast in you, and we boast in your word, we boast in your love, we boast in your grace and your hands that is extended once again. We boast in you, Jesus. We boast in the cross, we boast in salvation and deliverance, we boast on you Jesus these things we ask in no other name than the sovereign name of Jesus we come to say thank you thank you Lord thank you hallelujah in Jesus name amen thank you Lord hallelujah I'm just going to encourage you once again if you have not received Christ as your Lord and say you just go ahead and say father forgive me for my sins I am a sinner forgive me I know that I've done wrong. I feel like I'm not worthy, but God is not concerned about feelings. He's just want a confession. He wants you to come to him and he's willing and open in his arms and he's accepting you and he's forgiving you. So I want to smile be forgiven. Ask him, oh God, live in my life, live in me, live in my heart. Now God, let me live for you until you return so that I could return into your heavenly kingdom. So I want to smile you be blessed and walk with the Lord. Thank you, Lord.